Oh man. I lost both of my favorite characters and the new guy. Chris is uh, not coming. Oh no, I can't believe this. Oh, gosh, I am so sorry. Okay. Maybe you should, Maybe you I'm, should I'm, sit I'm down. I'm fine, Sam. Okay. okay. What about uh, that old guy? No sign of him. I think he's got to be dead too. Oh, oh Christ. All right. These all the doors? Yeah. Are you sure? What are you looking for? Another way out. Mike, look, I really don't think that's a good idea. We should stay put right here until dawn. At least we're safe down here. Oh, yeah? All wrapped up like a little present with a bow on top? That thing to tear us apart on Christmas morning? People will come for us in the morning. You don't sound so sure. That is what'll happen, right, Em? Yeah, I, I mean, right? Well, you can wait. I'm leaving. Mike, there's no key for the cable car. Josh, he's got to have it. Josh? His dirty little tricks. Great, great. That fucking thing got a hold of Josh. Then, we shit out of luck. I don't know, Mike. It's possible. What's possible? It may have taken him down to the mine. What? I saw some horrible stuff down there. I think it's where that thing lives, and. Huh. M. What? Fuck it. I'm gonna get that key right from that thing's goddamn bedroom, and then I'm gonna get us all the hell out of here. And what is all that? So uh, that old guy's bag. Is that a map? <gasps> that guy was prepared for anything. <laughs> Not quite. What is this place? Oh my god. Wait, 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 what is that? I was down there. It was horrible. You were? Some of them survived, but like 15 of them didn't make it. There was this reporter, and I think he figured out there had been some, like, big cover-up going on. I found these plans. They knew the mine was a death trap, but they let the miners keep working anyway. And I'm not sure what it means, but I found this chair. Dried blood all over the place, like somebody being tortured. Michael, I'd like to maybe focus on how we're gonna get the fuck out of here, please. I'm just saying, it's weird how much crazy shit's gone on up here. What's weird is that there's a tunnel leading from the lodge to the sanatorium, see? That's how I got back here. I saw this when I was down there. That's where it lives. Um? Um, what is... Huh? What is that? Ash. Um, oh my god, oh my god, it's, oh it's my god. Nothing. Oh it nothing, it just, oh it, no, it no, bit no. me and... It bit you? What bit you? The, the Wendigo. What? It's nothing, really. It's not a big deal. Does Wendigo transfer Bert? It doesn't hurt anymore, mm -hmm. really. It's it's not that bad. Em, if that thing bit you... I, I know what you're thinking, and I'm fine. Are you? Yes. Emily, at least let us check it out. Emily, if the Wendigo bit you, you could turn into one of the old man would have known. Ridiculous. He said it was from eating each other. Remember, he said oh, that. Is that how it works? Yes. It happens if it bit you, you're gonna turn into one, and then you're gonna turn on us. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god! Told you Ashley would be hysterical. Down here with us. What? Mike? You gotta go. Are you kidding me? You're putting us all in danger. Like hell I am! Emily, you can't. I don't think stay it here. works like that, Bert. Head, okay? we don't know well, they don't know that. Maybe it's just a bite. I. What is this? Guys, what are you doing? God, the old man would have been useful here, huh? Yeah, it's a shame he stepped on that twig. Yep. It's a shame that my controller has the shakes. Me to my death since you know there's a Wendigo out there ready to rip me to pieces like it did with... Okay, oh my god, will you just go? Go, get out of here! Ashley's already become my least favorite character. Oh, Jesus. I see where the guidance came from. It's this part right here. You're gonna shoot me? Mike, me? This is the safe room, M. Please. It is not safe as long as you're in it. No. Not for us. Don't, don't do this. I'm really sorry. I don't think it works like that, Bert. It can't. Shut up, Ashley. Shut the freak up. an eye on her. 
if you see anything weird. You guys know what to do. Yeah. No one leave. Okay? It's not safe out there. I'll be back soon. Ash is gonna try to kill her, huh? Who knows? I think she's gonna do it. She's out of her freaking mind right now. She's gonna do it. I thought that that he was gonna help us. Did the flamethrower dude? Now we don't have a chance. No, guys, it just means we gotta be tough. We gotta do this on our own. I don't know if I can. Oh, cannibalism. Only a few men have dared to hunt the Wendigo. I'm the only man who has ever ca Okay. I'm the only man who's ever kept them under control. Heed these words or it shall be your death, and your death will not be the last. The Wendigo must be contained. Grows out of cannibalism. When a human is desperate and craves food, trapped on the mountain, and will fiercely may eat nothing for days, this will possess them. Even the strongest man is weak to it. He will kill without remorse. Often those companions who have traveled with him, he will eat the flesh raw from the corpses. I've seen this happen many years ago, craving for flesh and not can be sated, and the change begins. The eyes first turn and become milky and white, then the teeth become longer, and the fangs, the creature grows. Bert. Mm hmm? Do you remember the old man had a kind of white milky eye? Oh yeah, but he had a scar on it too, so like he got, he's mm -hmm. basically blind in that eye. Maybe. His other eye was fine. It was. There was a tribe that lived in these mountains, the Cree. Shaman's stories, the uh, talk as you burned in ice. Yada yada yada. Come on, man, I'm trying to read. Uh. Every animal became sacred. The Cree believed that bad luck to harm an animal on the mountain. We haven't harmed any animals during this playthrough, though, right? So the Wendigo shouldn't be that freaking pissed. Miners ride, yeah. they found a tin and later traces of radium. They mine, blah blah blah. And cried out, the spirit was released. Okay. They become sharper and more dim. Sees movement. This says that because the Wendigos are mutated from humans, when they hunt us, they know how to perfectly mimic their prey. I see where this is going, Bert. I don't like it. Uh. It cannot see stillness. If you keep totally still, it will not be able to see you. Skin and flesh of the Wendigo are hard like armor. If you feel no pain, they cannot be cut or stabbed. Uh huh. We had this already because the man is wounded to a human. It knows how to hunt us. It can prove to mimic its prey. It must remain sharp and disciplined. I've killed six Wendigos. Knives or bullets will not harm them. Use a flamethrower. But, but try not to kill them. Killing a Wendigo should be the last resort. Death releases the Wendigo spirit into the air. Contain them, I use traps to catch them and fire to drive them into cages to traps for bait of human limbs from those who had no further use of them. One by one, I caught those who had infested the mountain. I'm guessing. Uh huh. Go on. So if you kill them, the spirit gets released. So maybe the spirit would possess her if we kill one. Yeah. That's my So guess. that's what I was thinking, honestly. It, it seems that to be that way. That that That's one win to go, but who the hell. Huh. I'm a little. I'm still a little confused on the details, but let's let's check this last bit here. Vincent Shaman's wrote rituals. Uh, found the da, 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 da. Copy the designs of them out on the mountain. They work. They keep the when to go at bay. Not entirely, but enough. But inside buildings, they do not work. I just say that the Wendigo grows from the bite of another Wendigo, but the bite is harmless. I have been bitten, but I did not change. The only way is to eat the flesh of another. There's no other way. I was right. I was right, Bert. Yes, finally, I made a right choice. Uh, yeah, Ashley, you're wrong, you dummy. No, 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 no. What? what is it? What does it say? Reassure. Yeah, I was gonna say. The guy knew knew what he was talking about. It says that the bites. It, if it bites you, it's not infectious. Do Only it. cannibalism. He said that in all caps. Let me see that. Uh, I'm sorry, what did you say? Um, it says she'll be okay. It says what? You're gonna be fine. Fine? fine? My
Michael almost shot me, is that she fine? Didn't shoot you. And this bitch almost let him. Hey, that's not fair. She was scared. I'm the one who's scared. I'm, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Emily. I didn't know what was going to happen. There's none of us know. There's no excuse. There's no excuse for this. Please just try to understand. Understand the palm of my hand, bitch. Damn! <laughs> Cat fight. I'm sorry. I'm so, 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 so sorry. Oh, never mind. You know, to be fair, Ashley deserved that. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> After getting Chris killed, but then I guess, oh, wait. Oh, Joshua. You should have listened to me. Because of your choices, people have died. I don't know which is worse, actively triggering events that lead to someone's death, or passively allowing a tragedy to occur. Because you couldn't lift a goddamn finger! To help someone else. Remember last year? Huh? How you left your poor sisters to die? You did nothing to help. Paralyzed by your own self-centered fear. While a real threat was closing in. Now it's all about you, Josh. It's always all about you. has gone terribly wrong. Tell me about it. Your friends like your sisters have deserted you. You're all alone. Can you feel how cold your loneliness has become? Huh? Why did you hurt them? Joshua, why did you hurt them? Uh, I think I heard, you know what, technically Bert, he didn't really hurt anybody, but the rest of that shit that happened was the Wendigo, right? We know what dragged the other girl out and caused her to die. And they never hurt Josh, right? No, no, they were dragging him off, I don't know if he was dead though. No, I'm not talking, I'm t he's talking, what is he talking about right now? He's talking about his friends. The right? other people, the other people. Yeah, his friends didn't hurt him. So why would he say they hurt me? He saw, I think he's talking about the sisters dying. That was what hurt him. He, that's why he did I this guess. whole thing, to get revenge on them. So I guess that's what he's saying. I don't know. I don't understand this. I'll, I'll answer they hurt me. Well, they didn't hurt you, Joshua. Not intentionally. They made a stupid mistake. And a terrible tragedy befell your sisters. You did not intend for that to happen. You just did. And they were sorry at least until you subjected them to your night of horrific torture. I am so sorry. Let's hope it's not too late for atonement. And that your friends, if they still are your friends, can save you. It's terrible. Isolation. Oh. So tell me, Bert. Hmm? Are you ready to make some bad decisions? You are. Yes! What? Let's have a recap oh, on what happened. So Not been. Chris! Oh. What? Yeah. What she you? did it. Ash, I, I hate so Ashley. Okay. I'm, I'm fine, Sam. Okay. okay. What about uh, that old guy? No sign of him. Wait. Don't move. Holy shit. Yeah, things could have gone better for him. What are you looking for? Another way out. Mike, there's no key for the cable car. Josh, he's got to have it. And what is all that? It may have taken him down to the mine. <laughs> Um, what is huh? Hey Bert, remember this? The safe room, M. I do. Please. Remember how right I was? Was there a prompt to not get bitten, or did that have to happen? I think that had to happen. I don't remember there being a prompt. I'll be back soon. Okay, despair. 
Dude, we are nearing the end game now. Let's see how many more people you kill off. Yeah, let's see how many. Let's. The goal is to get as many people killed as possible. Why am I locking this? Aren't the people behind me? Oh, is it actually counting down actively now? I don't think so. Oh, okay. All right. You don't think the what was that thing called a Wendigo? Mm-hmm. You don't think it's, it's going to come down here, do you? <laughs> of course it is. Why wouldn't it? Uh, good question. What do you think, left or right? Left, because it looks like you're not supposed to go that way. Hey, bro, you're, you're right. Yeah, you're right. I hate when you're right. Okay. Just thought I hit the light switch, but, you know, the lights aren't working. Look at this area, bro. It's huge. You get lost here for days and never find your way out. For a minute, I thought the AC was on, but it's just, I guess, the windows are open. Anything? Is there anything around to interact with? I don't think so. Alright. Let's get going to the... I guess we're going to the mines, yeah? Yeah? I think so. Where the hell are we? You're at that one place where the wolves were. Yeah. Wait. Sanatorium. Yeah, so the wolves belong to the old man, yeah? <laughs> I'd, I'd assume? Unless those were two different people. I... It couldn't have been two people. Oh, hang on. There's a picture here. Oh, it's the Miracle Men. I didn't get to look at it. He put it down immediately. <laughs> uh, it's the... Oh, it's the... The Twelve Miners. Those are the ones that survived. Think one of the, you think the Washington father was one of those guys? I don't know. Seems likely. Hey, Totem. I think. Their family may have just owned the mine. Probably. They're horrible people. Let's look into this horrible thing. Look into uh, it. Go further. I can't. What's wrong with the... No, maybe you already found this one. Maybe? It's yeah, I was gonna say, I was like, um... <laughs> sure, it's taking a sweet time to take me in and see the... Well, I wonder what that one was. Only one way to find out. Look for the one with the antlers. Yeah. There it is. Wait. Yeah, there it is. Okay, so this probably plays in right now, huh? Uh, I mean... It it was Mike's thing, and now we're playing as Mike. It seems logical that that is probably what's going to happen down here. Okay. I'm not seeing... I've already been here, though, so you've explored most of this. Yeah, so I came up the stairs. Okay, I need to go this way, I guess. Mm -hmm. Okay. Getting my bearings. Jeez, this is, uh... Since we've been here before, we know what to expect. Holy shit. Mike, you've been here before, right? Was it him that went in here? Huh. Or was yeah. it... I have another wolf. Uh-oh. Yeah, oh, no oh, right, this is where the wolf was. He was over here. Yeah. Oh, I hope he's still alive. Oh, that door that he was guarding might be where we need to go. Maybe. Yeah. There's Is something he... back there, though. There's something red in that locked behind that door. Yeah, I saw it. I, I was just trying to see there. if the wolf was still there. He's not here. Of course he's not here. He would have been all bark bark. Oh. I hope he's okay. Uh, let's see what's in here. In this one. We have. All right, then. What was the thing you were talking about? It's the next cage over. This one? Yeah. Ugh. Rock formations, what are you gonna do? I say <laughs> walking into way. it. Yeah, well... It's a skewed view, bird. It's a, it's a choir taste. Looks like a backpack in there. I think it's a chair. I can't quite seem to interact with it, so... Yeah, I guess you can't go back there. No, I can't go... Did we go upstairs last time we were here? Yeah, that's where you came from. No, I thought we came from this door when we came in here before. No, the wolf remember was that all... one was locked or whatever. 
Okay, so wait, the wolf was right. I thought I maybe my memory's bad, but I thought he was, the wolf was like right around here. He was. I can't go on that side or at least see what was he was guarding. Or maybe this is it. No. I think my memory has uh, gone that's bad. Lit up though. Yeah, that's important. But it's Not locked. Important. No, it's important. It's just locked. What can you do? Let's go to the next one then. There we go. Can't believe Mike came down here alone. I can't go left, even though it's open. My natural urge to explore is screwing me, Bert. Aha! Okay, you ready, Bert? Sure. Right, nope. <laughs> Ooh. That didn't look good for somebody. Was that Mike? Probably. We should we should watch it again. Okay, so we need to watch out for wild wendigo attacks. Holy hell. Makeshift graveyard, I bet that's for the miners. Yeah. So this is huge subplot with the miners thing, Bert. I suppose we're, uh, there's like some sort of completion bonus or something. You think there's anything you get for finding out all the mine stuff? Ah, uh, a trophy? <laughs> yeah, great, perfect. I, there's nothing back here. That's it. I went all the way back there for a graveyard. And I guess a danger totem, so I guess it kind of paid itself off at the end. We know danger's afoot. I assume all the Wendigos are the miners, right? Oh my god. I never made that connection. That could possibly be a thing. There's a key here. But that would mean there's like 30 of them, wouldn't it? Well, he did say, the old man did say he was capturing them, right? Oh, that's a cigar. We already, uh, yeah, we already seen true. this. Yeah. So, what does it mean? That, mm, you, you could be onto something, though. Oh, and that would explain the, I guess, why the Wendigos are here. The miners trapped underground so long would resort to cannibalism. Which, in turn, is what that causes some Wendigos. Some of them had to die, though, so there can't t be 30 of them. Mm -hmm. Some of them might not have been eaten. May mm. We know there are 12. I, I guess well, we gotta go upstairs. Did th Yeah, those, those are the ones that survived. Oh, right. Maybe those are the ones that turned. Maybe. We should probably read more into this minor thing. I think we have pretty much every clue on those guys. Alright, so I, I don't think we came up upstairs last time, Bert. Mm. At least not this part. Maybe not. Oh, it looks like you can drop down behind the Yeah, that's how we get in there. Now, how do we get out, genius? Probably opens from this side. Well, you, I hope so. Oh, look. Gun and ammo. That's a lot. Well, yeah. It's oh, like I was going to I was going to say, hey, what are we are we choosing which one to take? That's a torch. I just need a pitchfork and a mob. Yeah, look at it. Look at the detail on it. Put it up. Yeah, just <laughs> put that in your pocket. Oh. Yeah. We got it. Take the gun, please. I'll say, load your, load, I, I take a lot more than that. Jeez, look at this one, Bert. Good enough. Saw enough. I like it. Alright. Take more. Let you can never have him. enough. Aw. Oh, he only took like a handful, Bert. Well, See, this is where having more than one person would be helpful. Someone could carry that for you. Are you just... Oh, maybe you can shoot those locks. Oh, oh yeah, that would be the thing. Then we can go back and get more ammo. Nothing wasted. Uh, I doubt you're gonna be able to go back and get more ammo. I doubt it too. But if it was me, that's what I do. Let's blow it off. <clears throat> the other one. That'll teach. Right? No. 
the one to the next to it was locked, right? I th n yeah, maybe. Oh, it's the wolf again. It's the wolf among us. Hey, big guy. No. Happy to see me again, huh? Hey. I was hoping I'd run into you again. Uh oh. All right. Good boy. All right, pal. Come with me. All right. Here's the plan. I happen to see a map of this place, so we're not flying blind. There should be a way through the psychiatric wing that'll take us right outside the mine. Think you can handle that? Couldn't have said it better myself. This is the best. You know what's happened every time you've had a life in your hands? No! <laughs> <laughs> He's gonna live, I'm gonna, I promise you that. All right, everybody, okay. everybody, I promise you, everyone watching, and, and me especially, he is not going to die. Mike will die before this wolf does. This is a closed off area, that sign said. Oh, please. Don't let the he's Wendigo be here. Everything too. No, he's fine. He's around. just he's just excited. Oh, I'm going. It's got to fall. Damn. Check and move like you, Wolfie. Stuck on this side. Okay, to confirm, I am hearing yeah. Wendigo sounds in the background, yeah? You sure. Are. Okay, good. I just wanted to make sure. Are we in a trapdoor situation here? Is that what's going on? Alright. Just gotta squeeze through. See that? Do got moves. I like the wolf's name too. Mm-hmm. It's pretty good. The wolf will guide us to safety. We have the animal spirits on our side. We didn't hurt a single animal this whole playthrough. You're trying to think of one I hurt, didn't you? I don't think you did anyway. I don't think I did. There, there are those oh, there no. Are the Holy fuck. Let's not go through that door then. Jesus Christ. What the fuck have I got myself into? What's gonna happen to that one too? No, it'll it'll happen to you if you keep this up. 